it's probably boat four. Oh, boat five. Or boat one five. of the boats that don't oh, count. Oh, I just got another one. Okay. Oh, I just got another one. Finally. Oh my goodness. Now I'm it's like so a tsunami. It's wild. It's wonderful. We're back again. Who's playing this time? Me or you? Really, they've is all that been even requesting, a question? They've all been requesting for you to play. Hmm. Uh, do you think you would actually let me play? Yeah. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe and hit the bell notification so you find out if she lets me play or not. Getting here later in the evenings, like we have the past two nights because of the actual auctions. Basically, there's only a couple sides set up still versus when we come first thing in the morning. So this is what really we have to choose from. This one has the most money for the least amount of buy-in. I think this is like a race. Kind of. We should do it as a race. We should. You should pick. You should pick. Which one is gonna go over first and I'll pick which one. Let's go one, two, three, four, five. And everybody below, pick which one out of one, two, three, four, five you think is gonna go over first. Which one are you saying, George? One. George if you're just not picked first, one. You're last. She's picking one because she always goes to the left. So then I'm picking two. Because she never goes middle. No, I'm picking five. I'm picking five. She's gonna go right. Twenty-five dollar start. Here we go. I guess he didn't want to play. Here we go. Here we go. She did not let me touch the bag. I have no he wanted to play the I don't want to play card and and let me play. He must not feel like winning tonight. False. Hashtag false. He must not feel like she winning would not tonight. Give me the bag. She said. No bag for you. She said, like no my, soup for you. My lucky. Oh, oh the number first one, one just moved. went forward. <laughs> and so the second one two. just moved. Oh, Look just at you dropping quarter. quarters already. Number one just went forward. <laughs> number one just went forward again. I just lost a quarter. Where'd you lose it? In that playing field. In that guy's playing field. <laughs> oh, the second one just moved. Oh, it's almost a tie. May not be a tie for long if Elvis is singing. Elvis. Come on, Elvis, make number one go forward. I have a feeling she will not uh -oh. be playing to the right for my number five uh -oh. guess. Uh oh. Can I change my uh -oh. guess? Well, you went with number two. I went with number two first and then I went with and number five. And then you changed five. your mind. You've already changed your mind once. How many times are you going to change your mind? Well, are you going to play to the right side? Eventually, yeah. You know the rules. You know the saying. All right. I'm going to stay with number five then. Oh, look what happened to number two. Number it two kind of just... <laughs> number two kind of just... Back. It's it like, oh, yeah. on a sandbar. These are those little boats that we saw last time. This is like a little boat, a little regatta. Yeah, they call it regatta, don't they? Little money boats. Little regatta. That's what it is. It's a regatta race, oh, the right? Point, the point are moving. Would you call it a regatta race? Yeah. The point. What are we going to do if the coins fall on the actual boats? Eventually they'll surface, right? I don't know. Eventually it'll all move this way. I'm not good at predicting the future. It's all about gravity. Oh, boat number three just moved a little bit. If you, oh, boat number three and four. <laughs> if you got boat number three and five, you got boat number three. Boat number three is heading in the lead. That's a boatload of boats. Boat number one's ahead by a stern. Might be a bow. I don't know. Could be a starboard. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the race of a lifetime here. Would you say these boats look like the speed boats the camp trusted you with at the age of 16? My first job driving speed boats at 16? Yeah. No, the speed boats were much nicer. They were Bajas. Yeah, but were they made out of money? I don't uh, think you can get any no, better than that. No, not for a. Not for All a right, that was my camp. last quarter. 
definitely not made out of money. All right, boat number one is in the lead. Boat number two is behind. Boat number three is in the race. Boat number four and five, Haven't moved. she's given no attention to. It's looking pretty weak. Only 75 cents fell, but this you know what? Is... There was a quarter in the quarter of my lucky bag. Oh, you so still down, oh, to a she's down to a dollar, actually. One dollar hala. Okay, so it's been Let's worse. Let's see how much bleak. damage I could do and with four quarters. We're gonna have to decide. Do I put this one in the compilation of losses? Because they ain't nothing. Well, remember, one or two quarters solo can do a lot of damage, so. Let's see what happens. At the beginning of the setup, this is how we always lose. Nothing uh, is going to happen. I got a little happen. bit of movement. I'm out. All right. There's not many other setups. Everything's been played, so another buy-in. The house won, ladies and gentlemen. As embarrassing as this sounds, the house just won. Guess what? You I'm playing with Lucky Sock. We officially Lucky lost. Sock that was a loss, but there are no other fields open for us to play. They've been played, or somebody's on them. So, this is what we're doing. George was playing to the to the. I always left. play to the left. I'm gonna play to the right and see if I can get boat number five to fall first. This should be pretty epic. Here we go. She was trying to win. Let's see if we can get if he can get boat five to catch up with boat number one. Uh, or or boat five just completely and totally dominate. All right, I am dropping coins here, left and right, out of lucky sock. There's already a hole in it. It needs Frankenstein. <laughs> Already, Lucky Bag 2.0 is starting out. It's got a couple pinholes already. I feel bad for it. Jeremy's uh, taking his time because he doesn't want to clog up the machine like he has with excitement in the past. Because I want to win. I'm going to take five Boat just 5. Moved. Boat 4 is still in place. Come on, come on, give me a good push. You still have a long ways to go before you catch up with my boat. Not, not after this push. Come on, yeah! No push for you! Come on. Come on, give me a good push. One quarter. Give me a good push. Nice. Okay, that's good. Good, good, good. See, I told you one boat quarter. Boat number five is moving. You guys see this? Boat number five is oh, moving. Oh, one of the one of the walls is about to fall. I feel it. I feel it. There it goes! Oh. <laughs> Domino! If you chose boat number two. Effect. If you chose boat number two or three. It made three, it above the sandbar. I'm not sure. I honestly or don't know what that crushed. counts for right now. I'm confused. What if I go middle? What if I go middle? Yeah, boat number two made it above. It like pushed its way up to the surface. If I can go middle and get some of those coins, let me see what I can do. All right, I'm gonna see what I can do. I just wanna see. It's experiment time. Don't no, get nice. quarters. I'm still in it. I'm nice. still in it. I think I might have more than three quarters. Doing better than me. <laughs> Did I, ever I got tell lucky you? with the three quarters and then the one hit in the corner of my bag. Do you know what a water spout is? Of a whale? No, a water spout on like a body of water. Yes. What is it? Go ahead and explain your your definition. Oh. You got some quarters to drop. It's uh. It's basically a act of God that oh, creates all kinds nice of damage. Push. So it's a tornado on water. Did I ever tell you about the time when I was on Lake Erie and the water spout? There were three water spouts and I was out in a sailboat. With a family of... No. Didn't you have a family? Well, the there was. I didn't tell you this story. Didn't you have two families? I didn't tell you this story. You may have. I was stuck in Lake Erie in a in a sailboat during a water spout. Like the water spout went right by me. Oh no, a sailboat? No, I don't think I. I didn't heard tell this. you about that. No. Every boat story you've ever shared with me has always been on that speedboat. No, this was in a sailboat. Yeah, sailboats new. Really? Do you share? Do you share? Mm, I'm not sure if you're ready for this. I may not be ready, but I think the viewers at home are ready. Alright, I'm going back to the right. 
pan to the middle just to see what happens. I'm getting quarters. Oh, this, the wall on the far right is it's gonna- bending. It's bending, it's bowing. It's gonna fall next. Oh, Something's look at that about push. to happen. Look at that push. That was awesome. Did you see that? That pusher's looking a little bare right now. Because all the quarters Fun. just fell. My number five is still in it. All right, yeah, it hasn't middle. moved much. Going middle. Number, and... Boat number one's getting wedged between both walls. All right. Boat number one is almost out of the competition. Boat number five is definitely in it. Boat four is back behind. I don't even know where the other ones are, but if you got boat one, four, or five, you're still in it. Oh, yes, you are. Back in it. Fourteen dollars and fifty cents. Are we just gonna switch and take turns? Is that what's happening right now? Um, I guess that's the way it's happening. Because sharing is caring, right? Or when an Egyptian comes at you with a big knife and sword, you just give up the money. But one just moved twice, two times. Did you see it? Oh! Come on, why aren't you playing to the right? Because I'm going after boat one. I gotta rescue the boat. It's gonna be squished soon. So I don't want it to get squished. Rescuing the boat. That is how I got trapped in with an actual water spout on Lake Erie. So the executive director took a whole bunch of senior citizens out towards Peely Island, which is Canadian border. And um, this on um, Lake it Erie. Peely. Canadian. Okay. okay. Pele. 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 It's French. Pele. So, storms no, on bodies of quicker. water, they come out of nowhere. They literally come out of nowhere. And it's like this huge, dark cloud just came out I've of nowhere. I've never seen one in Lake Erie. I see one. I see one in Worcester all the time. I saw one in Marblehead today. Uh, so... What happens is these storms come absolutely out of nowhere, and he had them out on a on a sailboat. So another fellow, yes. and I, nice number one, is getting crushed in there. So another employee and I took out a speedboat. We I'll gave save the you number speed, one. We gave the speedboat to the executive director on his fundraising trip. We said, "You take the speedboat in. You get everybody to safety. We will sail the actual boat in." So that was the goal, was to sail the actual boat in, but the storm Ooh, came in too fast. That was my last quarter. But you're still getting more push. 1525, and Elvis is singing, I got to go. Okay, gonna I think it. we're gonna go, we're gonna go, we're definitely going to the right. All right, he's gonna go to the right. Boat number five still has a long way to go before catching up with my boat. Boat number one. So we drove the speedboat out. We got all the senior citizens and the executive director on the speedboat. Jared and I were out on the sailboat. We attempted to sail the boat in fast enough to miss the storm, but those storms move so fast, there's no way to actually beat a storm. A storm's gonna win every time. So at one point, we got into the bay on Kelly's Island, and there is a bay area. You've seen that. Nice. And we decided the only thing to do was to take, oh, nice, nice bounce. Take the 40-foot metal mast down, because we were watching lightning hit the lake everywhere. And we thought the only thing that was smart to do was take the metal mast down, and then get down in the sailboat, throw the anchors, and then ride ride the actual, ride the, the storm out. So, as we're trying to take the mast down, I'm going middle, I wanna push those coins. As we're trying to take the mast down. He's going for the ammo. He's getting for more George ammo. Lightning is literally striking the lake everywhere. Everywhere around us in one of these massive storms. That's so storms. scary. And the little sailboat is being tossed to and fro. This the setup actually reminds me. Of, uh, all right, I'm going left. I'm going left just for some quarters. Oh wow! For quarters, your boat is so buried. I just need ammo. It is, but you had a really good push. Oh. 
So we tossed the anchors down. Come on. Oh, there's oh, a good nice. push. Nice, nice. We tossed the anchors down. We had two anchors. Tossed them down. And, and unfortunately. I'm assuming you had your life vest on as well. No. Because safety first. No. That would be a very uh, wrong assumption. So. Oh, nice push. Nice push. So we, we go out in the storm. And we try and get the mast down. This is a 40-foot metal mast. You got, we're out in the middle of Lake Erie, so we are a lightning rod. We literally are a lightning This is one of my near-death stories that I tell you all the time. I can't believe I haven't told you this one yet. Not the sailboat. The sailboat mast will not come down. It is stuck. Oh, what a bounce! It is literally stuck and cannot get the mast down. And there's lightning. I'm watching lightning strike the lake hundreds of feet all around me hopefully we can strike a wind here not 1675 let's see what lucky bag just remember if do. your boat beats my boat i set you up big time there you set the stage for me so we dropped the anchors right we, we literally had two anchors but the anchors were dropped in the sand we have a mast and we got lightning striking all over. Jared was my supervisor. No joke. No joke. Jared starts crying, bawling. What? Crying How old and is Jared bawling. at the time? Well, I was 17, he was 18. <laughs> <laughs> the hail puts two teenagers out <laughs> in this. So Jared's crying, I'm like, dude. He's an adult, he's I'm officially like, an adult at 18. I'm like, dude. He was the supervisor of the waterfront. I'm like, dude, this is amazing. Think of the stories we're going to be able to tell someday. And he's crying. I'm like, you go under the sailboat. He's like, I, we took the sails down. I was like, you're cold. Just put the sails wrap around you. I go out to see what's going on. There is a water spout, which is a tornado. It is a tornado. When a oh, tornado is over the water. I went to the right and everything to the left is It's moved. either a hurricane. <laughs> which is huge, or a water spout, which is smaller. I literally watched a water spout go right by us with lightning hitting everywhere. Oh my goodness. The I'd be crying sailboat, too. sailboat, because it wasn't anchored in the sand, the sailboat, because it wasn't anchored in the, in the sand, just kept turning and turning and turning. It was literally like being flushed down the toilet. So that was my that was my toilet experience. And as soon as those storms come up on the lake, they disappear on the lake. So after being flushed down Lake Erie's toilet, literally, with yes. with the actual storm and the whole deal, we sailed the boat back in. It's sunny like crazy. There's sun out. We sailed the boat back in. Mother Nature was playing with your emotions. The that day. executive director. The executive director, this is the best part. He goes, All right, I'm down to two quarters. Oh! What was that? Two boat quarters. Number four? That was a boat that was on the top that oh, didn't count. That doesn't count. The executive director literally tells us, he goes, Good job, guys. Um, we had our eye on you the whole time. Don't worry, you were safe. You can have the rest of the night off. Here's 20 bucks. Go get pizza. <laughs> so I gave my life for $20 that and a night. And slice of pizza. 2225 and a hundred dollar boat. Elvis is singing. Here we go. Would you say boats, my goats? Um, Does that apply? I don't think I would say that, but I am gonna tell you I'm going for number five. Shout out to Eva who made Lucky Bag and Lucky Sock 2.0. We love them so much. Boat number one. Boat number is one is crushed. crushed. Boat number one is like It crazy. has no hope. <laughs> boat number one is like It's going to be like a pancake by the I'm time it... Boat number five. By the time it gets to the hopper, it's going to be a pancake. For all of you, you who chose boat number five, that you hung with me, I just want to want to say thank you for choosing Boat the number team. five barely moved. But going back to boat number one, it's going to look like a paddle boat by the time it makes it out of the hopper. Boat number five is women this regatta. But look at the wall to the left of boat number five. It's gonna crush. There's a there's a very high chance oh no, of oh it no. being crushed. Oh no, I and got the wall this. falling I down on it as well. I got a plan. Nice push. Look at that. Setting you up. I got a plan. This is gonna work. Jeremy's the man with the plan. 
Are you going to share your plan or are you going to keep it to yourself in case We're it doesn't in a work? Little bit of a competition on the here. <laughs> okay, there you have so it. He's going to keep it to himself. Why, why would I share that? In, in case it doesn't work. That's why he's going to keep it to himself. Quarterlands. Oh, nice. I set you up huge. Nice. I just set you up huge. Why, right thank there. you, sir. Thank you. So very kind of you. Oh, oh so my plan is working. Part my of the plan wall is working. Fell. The wall is coming down, <laughs> and the boat will be released to sail the seas. <laughs> Come on. All right, I'm getting number five. Get it, get it, get it. I won't share with you my plan. I might share another story. I'll just I be the side you. cheerleader. I took George to Kelly's Island and to the camp where I worked. I've shown her where all these stories have taken yeah. place. Well, I don't remember the sailboat story. I might not have ever. But you've worked on the island for how many years? All of my teenage years and then my early 20s. So you were, like, what, seven years? Uh, combined total? I don't know. We've only known remember. each other for almost two years, and you have seven years worth of stories. I don't think you've told them all to me. Really? Why do you keep telling me I repeat everything? Really? Why do you keep telling me I repeat everything? Are you a parrot parrot now? Really? Should I start calling you Polly? Why do you keep telling me I repeat everything? You like to repeat yourself because as a, as a teacher, you always say repetition. repetition come on, come repetition. on, come on, number five, number five, number five. Oh, number five, so close. it barely moved. Okay, but number one isn't in there either. Let's pull. Lucky Bank 2.0 is holding $25.25. $25. $25. I appreciate I the setup. Now I'm going to set you up. Uh, there ain't no way you're getting boat number one out of that. Yeah, as, as sad as it sounds, boat number one it'll is be trapped. a miracle. Boat number one is definitely trapped. Yeah, it sure is. Boat number five, on the other hand, still has a little bit of a sailing area through the canal there. But if your boat falls, if your boat falls, I'll give you full credit and props. I still think boat number five will get crushed. Did I ever tell you when I would go outside of the bay in the storms and I would take the speedboat and I would go out to the six, seven, eight foot waves and I would do Superman jumps over the waves and I would have to hold on. I would jump so high in the air with the speedboat. I would have to hold on to the steering wheel and I would be up in the air like motorcyclists or mountain bikers and they do the Superman. I would be doing that with the boat. That and then wasn't the, damaging to the boat. It's very damaging to the boat. I got in big trouble. <laughs> and it's also the funnest thing in the world. Oh my go goodness, so much fun. Yeah, oh no, you can't take so anybody else. So you treated the speedboat like a jet ski. I want you, you always have, you always have a reserve gas tank in case you run out of gas. I, you know what, I should not finish this end of the story. Let's just say that. Because you think it'll upset a lot of boaters. Um, I'm just going to say that I wasn't the only thing supermaning, but I could fly, something else only drowned. <laughs> That was right when Elvis started singing. Do I get a thank you? Or should I just say you're welcome? Excuse me, did you say something? I'm setting it up for you. Set what up? I'm I don't see boat five. I don't playing. see boat five moving anywhere. You're going to be playing next. I got you a bunch of George ammo. I don't see boat five going anywhere. No, it's not. And I've even, I'm even going to the right. I'm switching it up. I'm going left, right, left, 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 right. BABA -B -A start. Boat, 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 boat. One and two, one and five. I used to Superman out there. Oh my goodness, I had so much fun. Superman! You know how to do the Superman? It's a dance move. No. Have you seen the color of my skin? Yeah, you are pretty white. You've got some total dad moves, though. I do have some dad moves in Superman ain't one of them. Rhythm and rhyme. You weren't born with it. <laughs> yeah, I ain't got it. <laughs> Oh, come on. Boat number five is like the only boat. I don't even know where the other boats, if those even count. They have to. Two and three are right there. Where? Right there. You're, wow. you're claiming those as two and three? Wow, wow, wee, wow. Yeah. Right, she says two and three are there. So if two and three go, you guys are still in it. If two was your pick or three was your pick. But we all know boat oh number my gosh, five is going to be the winner. Boat number one is probably uh, drowning right now. Boat number one is where that gas tank was after I was jumping waves. All right, that was my last quarter. 
down under. I got some really good pushes. 43.25, time to get a boat. Okay, Georgia's boat. I, I still haven't gotten a thank you. For what? For all the coins all I right, got here's you. your thank you. I'm gonna play to the left, this is your thank you. Okay. I'm gonna play to the left. I'm gonna play all the way to the left, and we'll see what happens there. Are you okay. playing the left so that the wall, to assure that the wall will crush my boat? More or less. More or less. That's what I thought. That's part of your, your evil plan. What's so evil about it? Because <laughs> you don't want me to win. What's wrong with that? <laughs> I'm pretty sure you don't ever want me to win when you beat me all the time. I play to the right and to the left. Never once have you ever said, I really want you to win. Therefore, I'm going to put mouse traps on your hands. <laughs> I've also never said, I'm tired tired of winning. Here, you can win now, Jeremy. Who's more competitive, me or you? Oh, nice push. Uh, me, I always say participate, don't dominate. You go, dominate, don't participate. <laughs> I will crush you. That's what's going through my head. But now, that wall is about to crush my boat. <laughs> That's the goal. That's what I get. No, I'm giving We're you trying to be though. Terminate. I am giving We're trying to be ammo. Terminator. Are you good ammo? I'm doing a little push in there. Woo! I mean, that quarter bounce. Bounce it. Bounce, 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 boom. Come on. Look, this thing is on the edge. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Got a bunch of Georgias to fall down. The boats in the center are moving. They were they were nice. Going. Okay. <laughs> Come on. Get in the papa. Yeah, boat number one is Dunzo. It's totally Dunzo. Oh, oh, come on, come on. We won't be able to see boat number one fall. I think we might be able to. Oh, your wall just fell on boat no, number five. No, not boat number I knew five. that was going to happen. Not boat number knew five. It. Boat of Elvis. official, folks. How could you, Boat Elvis? number one has been crushed, and boat number five has been crushed. So you definitely won't be able to see the boat fall. It'll be pushed with the tower uh, point. Get some really good pushes. Oh, you're in this now. You Very can thank nice. me later for this setup. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I'll thank you now. My I'm always your side mind. cheerleader. Sounds you awesome. gotta give me that. You know my my infamous cheer? The you death know, battle the cheer? Cry. The death battle cry? No, the one where I go, give me a P. Give me a U. Give me an S. Give me an H. What's that spell? Winning! Now do All you right, remember? rapid fire. No, I have no idea what you... Are you speaking Egyptian again? And I'm the one with the bad memory. Man, so one is definitely in there. Five is in there. Five what do we have left? There. Two and three? Yeah. Let's pull. 4850. Not bad. Did I say thank you? No. I did? No. Well, if you didn't hear it earlier, I just did again. What? Do you need some Q-tips to clean out that earwax since you're having a hard time hearing me? Or is that, should, are you blaming it on age? Did you say something? Yeah, he's old. I was right when I said I basic vanilla ears. grandpa. Did you say LASIK? LASIK <laughs> vanilla grandma? <laughs> I, wanna, I want boat number one to fall. It still counts once it falls down the hopper, right? Yeah, if it falls in the hopper, it counts for sure. Okay. It's on the edge. It's I'll be smashed shocked. in the wall on the edge. Yeah. It'll definitely fall down with the, the wall of quarters. I'll be shocked if we could see it. Or if the quarters fall first. 
And then the boat surface resurfaces. Let's go down the middle. This is a tough one, honestly, but nobody it's played it. It's been a it. challenge, yeah. Nobody played it. Abby was tough. You went in and lost it. Yeah, I did lose. We may still lose it big time. That we was a good push. We cannot do another buy-in, or we are so we'll be out. Yeah. behind. We'll be in the negatives. How we many? We are in the negatives. I counted There's 11. There's not enough in there to compensate. I counted 11 money boats, and I'm assuming they're all single $100 bills. If we can get all 11, we're doing well. If not, chalk it up to another loss. Yeah. If you can get the left or the right walls to push so we have enough ammo. We, we can certainly get and rescue all 11 boats. So now it's a search and rescue mission. Yes, yeah. of course. Did I ever tell you about the time? Did I tell you the time me and Paul almost died out on Lake Erie oh, trying geez. to save somebody? <laughs> I didn't tell you this when we went up to the island. I don't think so. All right. Another huge storm came in. Another huge storm came in. Are you sure you're this not a cat? Day. You have like nine lives or something? This is a whole nother day. And we saw something out in the bay in Lake Erie. This huge storm. I mean, you're getting... New on day, Lake Erie, new when you're death getting, story. When you're getting seven, eight foot waves in the bay in Lake Erie, it's a huge storm. So we saw something bobbing out in the bay. And we had to pull all the boats and the whole deal. And I said, Paul, there is somebody out there. We have to go out there. And Paul goes, no, we are not going out there. We're not going to die. And I went, if it was you out there, is that what you would be saying? You don't want me to come rescue you? And he's like, fine. And so we back, we back Goldie. Goldie was the Jeep. And then we put one of, we put my speedboat in. And then, which was the Sunsport. And, and we were in such a hurry to go save this person. We forgot to put the plug in the boat. Any of you boaters, if you don't know it, there's a rubber plug in the back of the boat. That allows all the water to drain out afterwards. You also have a bilge pump that pumps water out. But if your boat is filling with water because you have no plug, your boat will be on the bottom of the lake. It'll drown. So we started out jumping waves, but then the boat got heavy and heavy and heavy, and we couldn't figure out why it got heavy because we forgot to put the plug in. So we drove all down. the way out. We drove all the way out where we found somebody bobbing. Guess it who was it was. Somebody? Guess who it was. Who? Your supervisor? I'm just going to call him Mr. Electric because it was an electric wire spool bobbing in the waves. And Paul's like, you idiot. <laughs> you made me almost sacrifice my life for this. We are going to die. So we got out there. It was an electrical wire spool that I thought was somebody dying. And then we were actually the ones that were going to die because the boat was taking on water. So to get the water out of a speedboat, if you don't have a plug-in, number one, you have to run the bilge pump. And that pumps it out the sides. Number two, if you go fast enough, then the force will just spit it out the back. But when you have seven and eight foot waves to go fast enough, remember my Superman jumps? Yes. You have to Superman jump everything. And Paul was a very, we used to call him Cautious Paul, and I'm anything but cautious. So Paul was very, very, very cautious. I had to jump the waves to get the water out of the hull of the boat, to get it back to safety. For us to save something that didn't even need saving, and then we were the ones that almost is just crazy. It was a rescue so, issue gone awry. Lesson learned: you'll use binoculars next time. Hales, no. Seventy-nine twenty-five rescue mission continues on. I got a new plan. I'm just gonna rapid fire in the middle and see what happens. I can see boat number one. Where? It literally is on the edge. All right, I'm rapid firing. Boat number five is definitely sandwiched between the two walls. I don't think it's moved at all. Really? Not even a little bit? No, maybe just a smidge. But right, boat number one definitely made its way to the edge. Alright, I jammed up. I'm gonna go rapid fire. Again, you definitely won't see boat number one fall. 
the quarters will fall with it and then it'll cover it. Nice. Getting good pushes. Getting really good pushes. That's my favorite push right there when the quarters all fall and they align and then you get quarters to fall from everywhere. Woo, just like that. I just gotta get the boats to fall. You clogged the This center. one is so tough. Yeah, this one has been tough. We've gotten one boat to fall so far. The next boat to fall will definitely be boat number one. Oh, come on, my rapid fire is way off. You know what nice I think push? we need? I think we need people shaking with us at home. Yeah, we haven't requested that that's in a while. That's why it's getting so tough. As you have. All this is shaking, everyone at home. I'm rapid firing too quick. I'm spitting them. All this is singing and shaking his hips. Everyone at home should shake, shake, shake. I think I can get the middle boats. Yeah, you can definitely get them. That might be what we end up getting, just the middle boats. I think this one is turning out to be an epic. <laughs> <laughs> We're just gonna be here for, now, I, for longer than anticipated. The last time we were here, we were at that one for almost two and a half hours. It didn't even, but the crazy part it. is it didn't even feel like yeah, two and a half hours. Yeah, it feels like it. That's because you're at home and I'm out getting up early, driving everywhere, all over Ohio, coming back. You choose to do that. You could work at some home like me and help me list on eBay. Here comes a nice push. Going for the middle boats. That's what I'm doing. I'm going for the money in the middle. Oh, you just had a quarter bounce and it hit one of the boats and it flipped over. That's right. That's how I roll. <laughs> it was face down and now it's up in the air. That is how Look, it's standing, I roll. It's like standing straight up. <laughs> Look, right. it's standing straight up. Just like... Help a boat out. Here comes a nice push. Oh, look at that push. Nice. Those are the pushes I like. There it goes. Come on. You got a little bit of a clogging going on to the right. Yeah, I... I'm, I'm rotor rooter in it right now. <laughs> I'm working on the rotor rooter. Here comes the rotor rooter. You know, my uh, my brother George used to work for rotor rooter. Oh, you knocked those money boxes nah. off. You had your quarter bounce and it knocked the money boxes off into the into that playing field. Wow. <laughs> Too bad they didn't come this way. That would have been nice, huh? Yeah. It would have been. All right, we're going over. I wonder if the casino does that on purpose. As like a bonus. Like if it happens, it happens. I always kind of thought it was just for decoration. I mean, I'm sure it's both. Maybe it's intentional. I don't know. But I like it. Oh, wow. That I'm boat in that the center? Boat. I'm yeah, getting that Yeah, it's boat. definitely going to fall. I for sure thought boat number one would fall first, but the guy in the middle, middle he's definitely going to fall. Boat. Get it! Get it, get it, get it! Holy cow! It's raining Georges. Come on! Oh, Elvis, Elvis is singing. Is singing. Kind of got to get it now. Come on, let's see what we can do. Just get that boat. Just get that boat. <laughs> it's so close. Oh. You just need one more good push and it'll fall. I'm working on it right now. I'm working on it. Come on. Get in the hopper. Get in there. 
I got it so close. That's it. I'm out of quarters. All right, let's hold it. 89.50. That's a little too much George for anyone. A lot of George ammo. I'm going to go for that boat. In the center. You're going to boat the goats? Boats my goats. Any pushes yet? Oh, it just moved oh, a little it's bit. It's about to happen. It's oh, about to oh, happen. it's on the edge. It's on the edge. <laughs> finally, finally, we're gonna get another boat. Oh yeah. Finally, we're gonna get another boat. Oh my god. Oh, finally. Oh my goodness. Oh, my finally. Oh, my goodness. finally. A few inches later. Once you go right, he's singing again. He's singing again. Oh, singing. It's, that's what I'm telling you. It's gonna be my boat first. If I got him singing on my side, I oh, he oh, moved it, moved. Boat so number close. one is right there. Boat number so five close. is right here. Which will fall first? Oh, oh my God! Boat number five. Boat number five. Oh, oh my okay. gosh! And that boat in the center the is about to What's fall. In the middle? It's about what to fall. What boat is that in the middle? It's probably boat four. Oh, boat five. Or boat one five. of the boats that don't oh, count. Oh, I just got another one. Okay. <laughs> oh, I just got another one. Finally! Oh my goodness! Now I'm it's like a tsunami. A tsunami wave and just push it go. A nap, some num nums, and a chair. How about some caffeine? Thank you, Elvis. Oh my goodness. Thank Do you, you think Elvis. boat number one will fall next? Uh, not if I have my way with it. I'm going all. Oh, I think boat number one will fall next. Uh, I, once you go right, you finally go right. But oh thanks to the left are moving, even this though you're has on the right. To be the longest. <laughs> Your back has got to be hurt as much my as My back, long. my back is on fire. Oh, I can't goodness. stand for long periods of time. So I just fight through the pain. <laughs> that was crazy. So other boats might have fell, but we're going to so officially what, yeah. say boat one that five. Fell. Boat five won over one. Boat five made it. Oh, I got some other boats well, coming up there. one is still hanging on tight. It's hanging on for dear life. Just let some go. Let boats. it go, boat one. Let it go. Boat one is still Join on the there party, the boat, boat, boat one. Boat one is still on Get the in edge. the hopper, boat one. When it came, when it came right down there, boat one. I'm shocked that it, that. It's still there. It's still there. And it, it didn't fall with the rest of the corners like I can't believe it. I, I made my predictions there. Oh, there it goes! It ah, nice. It okay, runner up is boat one. Runner up is Finally. boat one. Could be some of the other boats, but I don't know. We really didn't keep track of the other <laughs> ones. Oh my goodness. The two that are down there might be the ones that were on top. I just figured they were all the ones that were on top. Oh, oh, these ones on top are going to fall. I hope so. And I hope they fall. The one on the far left falls oh, the right God. way. Did I ever I'm tell you about the time I was driving a boat and it fell into a hopper? What? Oh. oh. Your boat? It fell into the hopper. <laughs> Somebody said, was it fell into the hopper. <laughs> Two boats are about to fall at the same time right now. Oh, oh one. just got one. Got one, got one, got one. Finally, got one. This regatta is on. <laughs> it is on. Okay, I still got plenty of ammo left too. Okay, if I can wrap the fire fast. I might leave. Push. I might leave one boat for you. Might. I'm not saying I will. I'm saying might. That boat's gonna fall I, anytime I want, now. I want all three of those over to the left. You're gonna take down the three to the left and leave me to the one on the right. I'm gonna leave the one to the right. Well, maybe. Maybe I'll just take them all down. Okay. There it goes. It just yes. fell. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Were you just singing? A few inches later. Soon. Soon we'll be able to go home. Or do you want to stay in place? We're just gonna stay the night. Oh, you just dropped yes. it! You finally dropped it! <laughs> finally dropped it! I say we need to go get dinner. It's almost what, 11? It's a late dinner. You mean like a midnight snack? No, I mean dinner. I haven't eaten anything. You 
call me hangry and then you yeah, wonder why. Yeah, you're definitely getting hangry. Oh, yes! you just finally, yes, yes, one finally, more. oh my one goodness, more, finally. One more and then I could drop the mic and get some food in your belly. I thought we dropped quarters, not mics. We're dropping both. Well, we did drop mic too, didn't we? We're, dro <laughs> We're dropping George's. We definitely, we definitely did. Definitely did. Come on, I need an awesome push. Give me a pretty push. I need that last boat. Oh, this might do it. This might do it. This might be it. Come on, Elvis. Save us, Elvis. Save Help us. a girl out, Elvis. This man's getting hangry. We can't have that. Oh, it moved, it moved, it did move. It finally moved. It did move, though. Oh, man. It moved again. Man, this has got to be the toughest one ever. Yeah, it's definitely not easy. Come on. Oh. <laughs> My goodness. I, it's like I feel like I need to teach teach somebody how to drive that boat. <laughs> With no training. That the person on that boat had zero training. Come on. Bring back the boat days. Come on. Oh man. <laughs> so close. Here comes something. It's gonna fall. It's, moving. it's gonna fall any minute. It's moving. It's just not falling. Definitely right wiggling. on the it's edge. Definitely wiggling. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Right on the edge. This is just Woo. insanity. I need to sit down for a few hours after a few hours of standing here. Man. Woo. But I think I told you every single boat story I ever have. Except that one time. <laughs> Massage. Is it too late to get a massage? That boat, that boat is definitely Egyptian. It's stubborn. Oh, then it must be, it must be a basic vanilla grandpa too because it's pretty stubborn. Do we really want that boat that bad? Yeah, it's right there. It's right there. We can't walk away now. Right there and we? going nowhere. Literally I mean, nowhere. If I end up playing all the quarters of my bag and it doesn't fall, then let's just walk away. <laughs> that thing is not budging. Look at the pushes and that thing won't move. We've gotten some sweet pushes and it barely moves. It jiggled, and Elvis is singing. Something might actually happen. Something might happen. Elvis is singing. Oh. Come on, get it, get it, get it. Get it, get it, get it. No! Oh! I thought we could count on Elvis. Come on, Elvis. I need oh, a good oh, uh, Elvis thrust. It jiggled. It's right on the edge. It's right on the edge. And it did jiggle a little bit. Apparently not enough. Wiggle it just a little bit. Come on, drop already. Drop it already. It moved a little. This is so crazy.
<laughs> it moved a little again. <laughs> it's moving, but it's not moving quick enough. Yes! Oh, it's so close. Yes! Oh there my goodness, goes. finally goes. victory! Rescued every shipwreck <laughs> All boat. All 11 banana boats. Three hours later, 1100. How'd you do on quarters? I got 178, 25 and quarters. Not bad. Now it's time to get some num nums and a nap. <laughs>